So I think I want to start uploading like smaller hauls. I don't know. We're just doing what we do. Sometimes I'm like, let's upload a 40 minute haul. Sometimes I'm like, I'm just going to put it on Instagram. Today I'm like, I feel like filming. I got a lot of stuff going on. So let's get started. So I did receive this in a little Christmas gift from Simply Watercolor Co., which was so nice of her. So she did send me a couple of her like, I think they're like $2 Tuesday sheets or something like that. So these are like little washi tapes with little like Louis symbols on them and then like little Louis borders. These are all in gold, little paper clips. This one is in hollow. And then these are just little icons in different colored backgrounds in hollow. Um, there are headers in gold, headers in silver, and then headers in gold as well. So that was just a little bit of um, stuff that was in the little Christmas gift. There was like um, like other non-planner items in there as well, so thank you so much for that. Then I also got this sent to me from Lauren of Rose Color Days, and she sent me these and then also these which i'll go ahead and open one of them i'll probably open the silver so i can show you guys what they are um they are tapes and then she also sent me these which are pockets so these are different pocket packs and like this one is pink and hollow this one is black and silver this one is rose gold and then kind of like a white and gray and then this one is gold and brown so those are different pocket packs they come with like a small pocket a big pocket and then a secretarial pocket but i'm gonna go ahead and show you these tapes so she did send me all four foils like all of her core foils in these tapes i probably should have opened them first so these ones are full box tapes and then the other ones are bottom washi tapes so i'm just going to show you what they look like so these are like clear you can put them over stickers so let me go ahead and find an end to this so this one has different types of confetti sorry if you people working in the background so you have like a top confetti that's heavy corner confetti top and bottom confetti and then just a top lighter confetti and then these just rip and you can use them in your planner as full box stickers so that is what those are and that is the silver version of those and then i'll go ahead and show you guys one of the bottom washi so she sent me silver hollow and rose gold i feel like these might have sold out already or they already were released um i usually get them the day after they're released i feel like so i feel like most of the times they are sold out so i'm sure that these ones she'll probably restock though I feel like some of the more like niche holiday ones she might not, but I feel like these she will restock, um, but don't quote me. So these are bottom washi ones. So these have two different size cuts. So this one would be, um, here we go. So you have two different sizes and these are just kind of her like confetti, which her confetti is like circles and diamonds. Like they're kind of, they're kind of like circly diamonds. And then they're the two different sizes. Let me see if I have a bottom washi that I can put them on real quick. This is actually a kit I have not released yet. Let me put it on actually on this. Whew. This is a kit I haven't released yet, but I'm working on rack bags right now. So I have this behind me. So let me go ahead and put this on here just so you guys can see what this looks like. I'll put that in my extras box. So many stickers. Okay, this is the long one. It looks like it's a little shorter than our bottom washi. Put this on here. Okay. So it's just a hair shorter. I'll show you the difference. Than our... I don't know if you're going to see. Yeah, you can see. So you can see it's a little bit shorter, but it's almost the same length it's just a hair shorter on that side as well you can see perfectly there actually so you guys can see kind of what it looks like but you could kind of like center it out and i feel like it would look good um but yeah i would say it's like just a smidge on each side shorter uh, but it's better than being longer because some bottom washi overlays are longer and it's kind of annoying because you have to cut them so those are the new uh, sorry tapes <coughs> my rose color date i just ate a, a whataburger chicken breakfast sandwich so those are the tapes 
that I have to show you. I know she's coming out with a lot of different ones, so definitely just follow her on Instagram for all the info. Then I have some stuff from Simply Gilded. This was like a really late order. I think I was just like online and I was like, I'm in a shopping mood. Where can I go to buy some things? So I did pick up some stuff from Simply Gilded. So let me go ahead and get these out. So, oh crap, I totally forgot about these. I don't remember when I ordered this. Okay, so I got three journaling cards. I got this one, which is really cute. So it's like a Christmas type vibe with gold. And then I got these two resolution cards in gold. Um, I might save this one in my Christmas decorations. And I like to put, I actually use the Lauren's Rose Color Days. Like, oh my God, Kirsten. She's really like hammering stuff in there. So I use uh, Lauren's of Rose of rose color days um usually i film at night but like i just am here and i have a couple minutes before we can leave for ikea so i was like let's film so um i used lauren's of rose color days she had like clear ones and i decorated in my house like because the clear ones look cool like i have pictures that are just normal pictures and i put them kind of like in front and then the christmas tree went around it so i think i might use this next year in my decorations and these i'll probably just put in my little declutter pile um then i don't remember ordering these ones so I'm not sure what these are. Maybe they just were thrown in. But I have these rainbow ones, which are really cool. I thought these look really cool if I use rainbow foil um, in black and then also in white. And then I always give Bennett the small ones because I don't use them. And he loves washi. He calls them stickers. But he's like obsessed with washi. And then I don't remember what why I bought these ones. But these are just like bunnies without foil. And then this one's like, I don't remember buying these though. And then this one's like a snowy city with hollow, but I'll probably just give those to Bubba as well. He's going to be so happy. He, um, I gave him a couple of wonton and a million ones that I got and he was like, he just loves them. He just thinks they're so fun. And then this one is, or maybe these came with this or something. I don't, that doesn't make like match. So I don't know. And then this one is black, which is a little bow and a heart, which I thought was really cute. I think I'm going to use that one in my aura still planner. And then I also got some seals. I got these to put on my Christmas cards. So I must've ordered these a minute ago. But I totally forgot. So I think I'm going to save these with that other journaling card and use these next year's to, next year to put on my journal to put on my Christmas cards. And then I thought these were really cute and I might use these to decorate uh, my planner just because they're really pretty. And then this was just the little freebie in there, which I'll probably just put in my little declutter pile. But these are super cute. And these are um, these are kind of on like the, I think like similar paper to like our matte wiggle. So super cute. Then I have, actually I'll show you the stuff from Once More Love because there's really not a ton here. So, let's see. I feel like I order from Marg once a week besides whenever she closes for like three weeks. Marg, come on. Creativity is contagious, pass it on. So then you do have um, your freebies here. So this is one of our collab freebies in the like sparkly hollow. And then there's this one here, which is the November freebie. So you have like the little fries, a pie, a elephant, a little family hugging, and then a little like blowing the like thing, like a blowing thing. Uh, I feel like no one really knows what those are called. Uh, nope. I got nothing. So I just ordered three sheets here. This was the one that I was looking for and I wanted to use for Thanksgiving. And I know it is on a freebie, but I can't find it. Also, I know that there's one with Lady and the Tramp on a freebie and I can't find that one either. So like I have this for next year, so I'm not like scrambling, but I could also probably use this for Christmas dinner. Cause I just feel like, I feel like I have actually like a lot of dinners with, with like people, like we're having like a little like New Year's Eve. It's not really a dinner though. It's more just like but it, it, it's fine. It works. And then this was requested by Emily for like a hundred years and Mark finally did it. Um, I don't get tattoos like super often, but I probably will get one sometime next year. So I thought that this was really cute and definitely useful because I don't have any other tattoo stickers. And then I also got the Baby Yoda sheet. I don't watch The Mandalorian or like any Star Wars related things. But I mean, Baby Yoda is really, really cute. I remember whenever I watched the first episode of The Mandalorian and I saw Baby Yoda and I was like, oh my God, why is he so cute? But like, I don't care about it any other way besides the fact that Baby Yoda is like real, real cute. So that is my order from Once More With Love. And she has some like real good stuff coming next year. So definitely stay tuned. I also got stuff from Michaels, but I showed it on my, I showed it on my, what's it called? My... Oh, I have other stuff I could show you. I can make this a little longer. Um, I ordered, what's it called? I got some stuff 
I have my other stuff at home. Hold on. Hold on, guys. Hold on. Okay, let me show you. Let me show you. Let me show you. Okay, so I ordered this. Or I ordered. I went to Michael's and I got these. I got um I got this sticker book. And I got this sticker book. And then I also got a notepad, which I needed a notepad at home for like writing lists. And I thought having one that was like Marg related would be cute because then I could think of her every time I write a list at home. So I put that in my like list, like in my junk drawer with like a couple of the pens because also we have no good pens in that drawer. Um, so I did get these sticker books, which are super cute. Um, I thought they were adorable. I'm actually going to give these to Bubba because he like collects his little stickers and I'm going to show him like how to put his stickers in here. And I think he's going to think it's really fun. And then this is just a little sticker book on clear. And I was using this to kind of decorate my cloud. And then this is also a little sticker book here of holiday stuff. And I was actually just using these to kind of decorate my weeks. I just put like one sticker in the little corner box and was just kind of like using it for that. So I wanted to show you guys those couple of things. And like I said, I also picked up the little, um, what's it called? I picked up the little um, pens, which I'm using in my little junk drawer because I, I use just like a pen like every day. Um for writing something and then I also picked up the little notepad to put in there so that I have something of marks to see all of the time. So I just wanted to go ahead and show you guys some of the stuff. Oh, actually I'll show you the Sadie sticker order first. I'm all over the place, but like welcome to my life. Oh, here's the other, the other item. Okay, so I'll show you guys the Sadie sticker order and then I'll show you guys my jet pens order. Ah, I love my cloud. I love my cloud so much. She's so beautiful. Okay, so. Let's go over the Sadie Stickers order first, and then I'll show you guys my stuff from Jet Pens. I haven't ordered from Sadie Stickers in a minute, but I knew I needed to restock on. Why did I order these? I thought I ordered the small ones. What is wrong with me? Okay, so ugh, I'm so annoyed at myself. So she came out with like star, um, like her little like I can't even think of what this is called, like constellations type thing. Let's see. No, I did order the thin ones. I just got sent the thick ones. I'll have to message her. So this is the um, Constellations release. I guess that's what it's called, or Star release. I don't know. So what I did here was, is I ordered, she has these, which I'm going to use as like bougie boxes, um, if I do like star related spreads. So I got seven of each so that I could do two bougie in each foil color. So I got gold, silver, and then hollow. I don't realistically think that I'll probably do that many star spreads anytime soon, but I'd rather like have them than not have them. And also I feel like if you wanted to do this, but didn't like want to buy as many, you could just like sprinkle some of these throughout your spread where you maybe only have two things in a box because realistically you're bougie. You don't see a ton, especially like you'll see like a sliver. So you might see like one star. So I think I'm like going to debate on if I want to like but I feel like if I did it that way, I'd have to like plan ahead or like plan as I go almost. I don't know, but because I'm also lazy. So maybe I'll just do all of them and just call it a day. So I hope that she comes out with these like maybe like once a year so that I can stuck up. But those are that. I had some messages that people were like, why did you order seven? And I was like, because that's that's the math. And then this is the uh, full box. And I figured I'd probably just use two per spread because they're like kind of different. And I'd use one on each side of the spread. So I got two of those, so that'll last me two spreads. And then I also got some of the header overlays, which, did I actually buy header overlays? No. So she sent these. Maybe I can just cut these. I don't be a pain in the ass. All right, so that, oh, she sent me a bunch of stuff. All right, let me, this is, I didn't order those. Let me show you what I ordered first. So this is, oh, she sent me the extras. I'm a turd face. All right, so I actually probably give Emily these. She like, she prefers the like big ones. So I'll probably give these to Emily. So there's hollow, silver, and then gold. Here's what I ordered. So these are the thin ones. I was like, I don't think I've ever had a mistake in a Sadie order sticker ever. So I was like, kind of like, that doesn't make any sense. That's why I even pulled it up. And I was like, that's probably a me thing. So these are the thinner ones. So I like doing, I don't think I've done like a full thick, like bottom washi like this in like probably over six months, definitely over six months actually. It might be longer than that because in my planner I have from July to now and I don't think I have, 
I feel like one of you will correct me if I did, but I'm pretty sure I haven't done any thick ones. So I like doing one of these on the like pattern part of the bottom washi and then a bow one on the 15 millimeter. And these are really pretty. Again, will last me two spreads. And then that's everything I ordered. The rest of the stuff she sent to me. So these are, like I said, the big ones. So I'll probably give these to Emily because she does prefer those. And then uh, she sent me these really cute little moon phases, which are adorable. Those would be even cute just to decorate like full boxes with. Then she also sent me some of the headers, which are super cute. So you have the headers in the constellation, which is another way to do bougie on a budget is you could totally like get enough headers, which I feel like you kind of need, I'm going to say roundabout probably, oh, let me do some math, seven times, probably like, probably like 35 35 to 42 headers to bougie out not do your headers but to bougie out your spread and not do like anything like extra behind your stickers so you like you put one of these down and then put the label and you can even cut them I feel like you would need like 35 ish ish um to do a bougie if you want to do with the headers and you can also half cut these pretty easily with just like a ruler and a slice tool and then also these ones just are really pretty I prefer something like this because I like to put the I don't like really using any I don't know actually I've never done this maybe I should try I don't have enough to do like a full spread because these are only how many are in this one two three four five six seven eight so there's 16 so I would need two sheets of these to do like a full spread of headers um, but I like using these on the like sidebar like I'd probably do like a heart and then I mean a star and then a moon I think that'd be really cute so these are super cute as well so that's everything from Sadie's stickers I feel like during the holidays, I don't really order as much stuff. I feel like I kind of like am like so focused on not only just my shop, but just like life that I forget to order things. So I'm like really excited to kind of be back in the zone of like being a consumer because I feel like I've missed out on a lot of releases just because I haven't been paying attention. So, 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 so. Let's go ahead and move on to my Jet Pens order. I loved all that stuff from Sadie Stickers, obviously. So I did place a Jet Pen order, um, and I got a bunch of stuff. I'm actually going to pull the other stuff off of my cloud because I've been using it. So let me show you what I bought. This is extra. This is really extra. Okay, my camera needed a minute. So I did order some stuff from Jet Pens. I mostly needed to place an order for my Energel Slena Clenas. These are the pens I use every day, like everywhere in my planner, everywhere just in general. And I just ordered nine of them because that's what they had left in the pink color. The pink's just like the outside color. They have like pink, blue, green, like all different colors. But these are my favorite pens. Honestly, I I don't know where they go. I feel like people might come in and just like thieve them. I don't I just don't know where they go. Like I have no idea. So I'm gonna go ahead and show you guys like how they write. So these are like super thin. They're they're uh, 0.3. I think they also have 0.5, but these are the ones that I use in my planner. I've never actually had one run out of ink. That's why I don't know where they go, and I feel like I have to have at least 10 somewhere floating around. But, um, yeah, these are my favorite pen, and I just love them, and Jet Pens is, like, super easy to get them. But I also have them linked in my, like, little Amazon thing, so if you want to pick them up there as well. And while I was there, I was like, why not just get some other things? So I got these uh, glitter gel pens. These are, like, way thicker. I think these are one... I'm pretty sure they're one. They are thickums. So these are just like some nice glitter gel pens. They had like good reviews and I just wanted some like super basic colors just to have like in a glitter gel pen in case I wanted to write something like cute with a glitter gel pen, you know? I thought that maybe like I can like write my like plan with me is like in my planner really cute or something or if I wanted to write like a cute title. For a notes page, I could bring out my glitter gel pens. These are like very thick and um, and luscious so really love those oh yeah look at that oh she pretty that one this one like this blue one it looks blue like like dark blue flat and then you tilt it and it has like that really pretty like greeny color oh. even this one's purple and you tilt it and it has a blue i'm in love with these these are the oh yeah one pen two colors all right so this one's like blue and green this one's, is this one black and red what oh, i guess they have the colors on them I'm dumb. I don't even know what I buy. So, ooh, that one's cool. That one's like black and red. I'm into these. These are by Pentel. They are the one pen, two colors liquid gel roller hybrid dual metallics. 
thought these were really pretty got those I also got two of these pens which I feel like a lot of people like to use um, so they are the Kawaiiko Ala Sport so uh, this is the Ala Sport and this is the Sport I don't know I don't know I'm not like a pen person but I thought these were really cute and they look really cute in my cloud so this one's like super expensive I think it's like 70 some bucks and this one's like 20 bucks and then I got the refills that fit in like pen gems if that if you are familiar with pen gem refills um I think that they're a point four um which I don't like those refills for writing on stickers but whenever I write in my cloud I'm mostly writing on paper anyways um they're they're definitely not as good of ink as the Slenas but they work well for just writing on paper and I think that the clicks very smooth this one's definitely way more weighted but for obviously $70 it better be like something miraculous and this one definitely feels like way cheaper but they both have like a cute look like they both look neat like this one has the gold and the white and this one has the silver and then the gold so I really like these and I just wanted a cute one for my cloud then I got these which are the clean color dot and I wanted to use these to make bullet points with Marg recommended like something like this to me and um, for doing like bullet points in my cloud, I wanted something super easy. So what this has is it has like a fine tip side so you could like write with it if you wanted. That's like constant sizing. And then this one's like a, like a, it's kind of like plush almost. So you can kind of like push it to make different size dots. So depending on the pressure, it kind of does different dot sizes, which I think is pretty cool. Um, and they're like pretty opaque so I just have the gray one in my cloud right now and I figure I'll just switch them out as I want and this is what that's called if you want to pick these up you could just I think you could just look up like dot marker on jet pens and it'll come up but they have all different colors in here as you can see the colors on top and then they're just really pretty and like I said I'm going to use the gray one for now but I can see myself like being like oh I'm in a pink mood and then just dot in my way through so I'll probably just like kind of get used to like one pressure and then just kind of dot so I got a bunch of stuff and I was like I'll just add it to this haul because it seems to make sense so this is actually like compared to the last clip this is like my desk and the other one was a poster board and I feel like this does this look whiter I don't know but I'm also afraid of like because there are like a couple actually there's not any I'm just afraid of this like chipping but I guess if I had to get a desk every couple of years for my key, it's not like terrible for filming purposes. That sounds like really dumb, but at the same time, like it's my job. So let's go ahead and show you guys the other items that I got. I'll show you guys the like non-commercial items first. So I did get an order in from Sparkly Paper Co. And now that I'm like seeing it, I'm like, ugh, darn. Okay. So here are the stuffs that I got. That's cute. Oh, that's super cute. Okay. Um, aw, this is cute too. I'm going to save this. This is adorable. Where am I going to put this? I'm going to put it on my sticker binders. Okay. This is adorable. A little journaling card. Actually, it's a huge journaling card. But I'm going to save it because it's cute. Um, then I got a little sticker freebie just on matte paper. And then I ordered some acetates. And the only thing I'm thinking though is, oh darn, that one like transferred. Um, so the only thing I'm thinking though is that these won't work in my cloud. I mean, let me see. I wonder if I can just cut them a little bit smaller. I mean, I feel like they would be like a little bit shorter on the top and the bottom. But not so much shorter that I would like be super bothered because I probably would put them over top of a paper. So maybe these will work. So I got the sparkly hollow. I got the regular hollow. I got the silver. And then this one's gold. It's like a little, if you can see. Let me zoom in. It's like a little transfery. And I don't think she has these online or I would just order another one. But I don't think it's like too noticeable. I just have to store these differently. I think maybe like back to back with a sheet of paper in between. I think I'll do that. Let me do that actually now. Or just I guess like this. Or I mean, that's how they were stored. I don't know. I have to figure that out. Let me know if you know any storage tips for those. 
And then I did order some of her foil sheets. So I ordered these, which were like the Fox and Pip collab with like the Lux kind of look with like the Louise type things on it. And I don't know when I'm going to use these, but I'm going to use them sometime and they're going to look really, really cute. Maybe with January Mystery. Then there were these um, Disney Plus foiled stickers. They're kind of big, so you have to use them in like a half box. But I still thought they were really cute. So I got the like sparkly hollow, regular hollow, gold, and then silver. So that's everything that I got from Sparkly Paper Co. Then I also have some stuff from Fox and Pip. She sent me over a cute little package. So I wanted to go ahead and show you guys the stuff she sent me. Everything was individually wrapped. I just like opened it all. So she sent me this ruler, which she's not selling the glitter rulers, but she's selling like other colored, I think like pink and like clear. Um, but she's doing like all this acrylic work in shop, but this is so cute. It's definitely gonna go in my cloud. Um, so she sent this over and I just love it. I think it's super cute. And then she sent me a bunch of her charms. Um, so here is the first one. So they just have like a lobster clasp and then this one is like a little speech bubble with a heart and a one. She also sent the same ones in the white sparkly, which I do totally love this like white sparkly acrylic. I'm sorry for my cuticles because that's just my life. And then she also sent over these two A ones. So the first one is like a cutout A with like little uh, stars and then the other one is the A with the bow. Super cute. Thank you so much Amanda. I love those. Then last but certainly not least, I did get an order in from Once More with Love and let's see. There was a journaling card and yeah so there was a journaling card on there. Um, and then I did just place a small order because she had new releases. So there is this one, which is a Valentine's Day sampler, which is super cute. I love this. And then there was an I'd Rather Die, which is inspired by my I'd Rather Die sticker on my sheet in my shop of munchkins. Um, there's that one. And then there's this one, which is the Lunar Animals, which I figured you could totally use this just as like animal stickers. You have the Monsters Inc. stickers, which are super cute. And then the Ohana Means Family stickers, which are like Lilo and Stitch. And then there is also the Freebie, which this is where the Lady and the Tramp sticker was that I've been looking for. But that is that. And then I wanted to show you guys some of the commercial items. I got all of these on Amazon. And I got them all for my cloud. So I wanted to get some tab stickers just to mark specific pages, mostly in my... Um, this one's really cute. In my um, like work planner, so I just bought these, which are tab tabs, easy dispenser from Post It, and then also from Post It, I did get these like page flags, and these are all like metallic, which I think are super cute. And then from Avery, I did get which these are like kind of similar, just like a little different. I did get these ultra tabs. These are the two sideable writable ones, smudge free, mini, and then margin. So I just pulled out the gold ones and stuck them in my planner so that I can tab pages. And then I also bought these. I saw Candace Jess in one of her like December videos use these pens. And I've had them before. I just don't know where they are. And these are like different than the ones I've had. But I um I wanted to use them in my cloud because I do a lot of like writing and erasing. And I thought that these ones actually looked really nice. And these are by Friction Pilot Ball Color Sticks. Um, so they are erasable pens. If you put them like out in the heat, they do like disappear apparently. Everyone else, like when I haul these in the past, that's what people told me. So these are like gel-ish sort of pens. They're not like, because they're erasable, they're never going to be like super opaque. They always have kind of like the slightest bit of like, not transparency, but they don't look like... They kind of look like a gel pen that's like slightly running out of ink if you guys can see that. But the cool thing is, is you can erase them. So I'm just going to pick like a color and keep it in my cloud and then erase. It's probably, this isn't like the best paper to use, huh? Because that's like a, like a label paper. So it's kind of like glossy. But it had all different colors and I thought that these were pretty sleek. The ones that I had in the past were more like... Uh, they look kind of like this, like a click pen, not very cute looking, but I thought because like, you know, like these two especially would look good like in any planner. 
just kind of sleek and I like the colors. Or if you're doing like a Christmas spread and you wanted to use like a red pen, I think these are all pretty cute. So then like, yeah, you see on regular paper, it like just erases. But it's still a pen, so it gives you that like pen look without using a pencil because I'm not like really a pencil person. You can still kind of see it, but like I'm not trying to make my like work planner look super cute, so bought those as well. And that is everything. I also bought some post-its because these are one and a half inch wide and I just took one of them and I'm just going to use the rest of them. I use, I use post-its like all the time, um, like in work for the most part, but I took one of these. I don't remember what color I took. Because don't they all look like they're here? I for sure took a color though. Oh, they might have been offset. Um, but I took a color of these so that I can write notes and then just stick them like on the days. Because they're 1.5 inch wide. So that's also from Amazon. So that's everything for this portion of the haul. It might be the end. I don't know. We'll, we'll see.